Okay, welcome to our Deep Blue Discoveries Build a Coral Reef Pool Program. We're gonna have so much fun in just a few moments, going down to the pool, building replica coral reef, playing fun educational games, and then at the same time, learning how to protect our oceans and protect the reefs. We have this globe, 70% of our earth is covered with water. 90% of that water is oceans. Yet, we've explored less than 20% of the oceans. It's responsible for the air that we breathe, the food that we eat. And within these beautiful oceans, lie what we call these majestic underwater ecosystems called coral reefs. When we talk about coral reefs, coral reefs protect the coastlines of many, many, many countries around the world. It generates billions of dollars in revenue each year. Also, too, when you talk about coral reefs, you're talking about many, many of the marine species that are dependent on coral reefs for their livelihood. So coral reefs are so important. And what's great about what we're doing is we're trying to educate the children in a fun way. Anybody here been snorkeling before? Okay, all right. So we're gonna review snorkeling skills for those people who have not done snorkeling before. We've got a mask for you. Then we have a mask for you. Then we have a mask for you. Okay, everybody right now, let's get in the water. Good. Oh, good. There we get in the water. Okay, mask in the water. Good! Beautiful! Nice job! Good. What we're going to be doing right now is we're going to form a circle, all right, and we're going to pass it amongst each other, okay? Here's the fish right there. Now we look at coral reefs, that's what we think about. We think about right now, we think about fish. And we think about lots of fish. Corals are actually made up of little animals called polyps. So coral reefs are really actually colonies of animals. So what we do right now is we're going to be putting together our coral reef colonies of animals. When we talk about coral reefs, Coral reefs are amazing. These polyps, okay, these polyps produce the rock-like substance that make the coral reefs. That's pretty amazing. These little animals actually help to build the coral reefs. Okay, now, watch me right now. The reef goes in, okay? Okay, now what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna start to hand out coral, and I want you to start to put the coral on it. So what we're going to be doing is I'm going to hand out different types of corals, okay? Now, what I want you to do, nope, everybody's going to get a chance to put, put the coral in, okay? So I'm just going to hand out coral right now. Building the coral reef, fish, lots of fish. Okay, let's see what we've created now. Hold on one second. We'll bring it up. Wow, look at this. My goodness. Oh my goodness, look at this everybody. Come on over. There we go. Okay, now let's bring it over here. Whoa! What a masterpiece. Look at this. Coral reefs are under a lot of threat right now everybody. What if we had this plastic bag in the water, mask and fins on, I mean mask on. Okay, what does this look like in the water? 
It looks like food. That's right. What What do you think happens when a fish starts to eat plastic? He gets excited and he gets stuck. Exactly. They could die. Okay. So basically, yeah, what do we do? When we take plastic, okay? We take plastic. We put it right over here in the bin, okay? What happens when I put motor oil, even just a teaspoon of oil, into water? It begins to look like this. Everybody put the mask on right now. Okay, everybody look right here. Go touch, just watch. Okay, this is oil in the water. Okay, now, what do you think happens if oil starts to get on the reefs? Are the reefs gonna live? No. How about the fish, are the fish gonna live? No. What happens when we put pollution in the water, okay? This is sediment. This is what dirty water and polluted water looks like, okay? Let's go, mask on everybody. Let's watch this, okay? We're putting polluted water in right now, okay? All right? Now, what happens to the coral reefs if we put polluted water on the coral reef? Are they gonna live or are they gonna die? They're gonna die, okay? So, what do we do? With, with items such as the plastic, the oil, and the polluted water, okay? We recycle it or we clean it up. So we go, and what we do, you see our bin right here? Everybody, okay? Everybody right here? We put everything into our, our recycling bin, okay? Okay, polluted water, recycle it, or we get rid of it. Plastic. We put it in. Oil, we put it in. What happens if we don't take care of the reefs? Can the, can the reef fish uh, live? No, okay? What happens to the reefs when we put boots on? Can they live? No, okay? What happens, what happens when we take care of the reefs? Will the reefs be able to live? Yes! Okay? Will the fish be able to live? Yes. Will, will we be able to snorkel on them? Yes. Yeah. Okay. Everybody, listen up. We take care of the oceans, we take care of the reefs. We're actually taking care of us. Now, for many, many years to come. Thank you so much for coming to my deep little discovery. Everybody hold up the pool, okay? Hold up, hold up the ball right now. I want you to take a one commitment right now. You're gonna take, okay, one commitment right now. You're gonna take, everybody get your hands up. Okay, make a commitment right now to take care of the earth. What's the commitment you're gonna make? Make our earth and our reefs better and our ocean better. Think about it, one, one thing right now. Thank you so much for coming to the Deep Blue Discovery School program. Give me a high five, everybody. High five. Coral reefs are under constant threat. So what's very, very important is the fact that we're able to be able to take care of the reefs and also inform the parents, inform the children. The children are the stores. And the children are the people who can be taking care of our reefs now and our oceans. So we can talk to children now about our reefs. It just makes it so much more important and so much more valuable. Jeff is amazing. I brought my two daughters, one is 12, one is 8, to this lovely program and I think they discovered some new things that, uh, to be honest, I personally didn't know and uh, it was a pleasure for, my, for me as well. I saw them like in the swimming pool, having fun, learning things, all, uh, very excited and uh, I'm very happy that we are here. I liked it because you got a chance to play with the coral and you got to play with fish. Learned that it's like pollution is like bad for the environment. And, uh, that you should like keep the coral reefs and oceans clean. Next time I see a plastic bag on the beach, I'll pick it up and put it in the recycling bin.